Hello everyone and welcome back to our YouTube channel. Today's topic is how to recover lost or forgotten passwords for any of the websites that you've ever logged in through the Chrome browser. If you're interested in the video, be with us till the end. Just go to your Google web browser from the browser page over from the web page what you have to do is just go to this section that says pause you can find your pre-registered email id here or you can find any other option with an email id icon here uh, with which you've already registered the google through the device uh, so just click on it and as you can see this information so this is the email ID that might have been connected with your Google services. So to check all the passwords, what you have to do is just click on this key icon. As you click on it, here you'll see the scroll down a bit and you'll see all the passwords of all the saved numbers of all the saved websites that you've been using. And if Whenever you feel like checking it, you can check it directly by clicking on the I option. Any of the websites you can open directly by clicking on the I option. Or if you want to remove these, just click on these three dots. So now there are these options, copy, edit or remove. To remove, I'll just directly remove the password. Now let's see what about the other options. So if I click on these three dots to copy, you know, the passwords will get copied and you can paste it. Now to edit, if you edit the password, you can just change the password from here. So, but to edit the password, you'll have to type the password of your Chrome, of your Windows account. And after that, you'll be able to edit the passwords or change the saved passwords so yeah that's about it and there are other options as well uh, in case you do not want to save the passwords what you can do is you can just turn off the auto sign in and you can turn off the offer to save passwords so like this whenever you try to log in through any other websites you'll have to enter the password at that time every time you log in and it won't be auto filled so you'll have to remember the passwords and because we turned off the offer to save passwords so any further passwords that you use or try to use on this device will not be saved like these so that is a plus point if you want to do that otherwise as some people want to save the passwords so they can choose as they please 